Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Black Emoji here. And I want to discuss um, Dragon Ball Super Episode 64. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm just going to do a, a review on it as you will. Um, but without further ado, let's get right to it. So I watched the episode. It was pretty dope. I loved it. I know all of y'all enjoyed it. And um, the reason why y'all see Black Zamasu in that picture is just because it is going to happen in Episode 65. You know, that's when we're going to see his full power and what he could do, what he's about, how strong is he, and all this other stuff. But I'm going to get more in-depth into this in this video right now. Now, I'm going to talk about the episode, and then I'll talk about the rest of the stuff in a later date. So, of course, the episode starts out, Vegeta's fighting uh, Goku Black, of course, and they're letting Vegeta shine hard. He is whooping and beating and messing up Goku Black. And Goku Black says to Vegeta, you just in um, Obsessor, don't get carried away any further. So Goku Black takes a back swing, he misses. Vegeta swing, throws him and swings him around and throws him into a building. I thought that was pretty epic. Uh, Gawasu and uh, Supreme Kyle watching, of course. So, of course, Samasu is looking at what's happening to Goku Black. Of course, Vegeta's annihilating the dude. So then, uh, Goku is like, hey, I told you, Zamasu, that you're fighting me. So then Zamasu turns around and says, and I told you not to give orders to a god. And I was like, ooh, you, you know, you know, it gave chills. So then Goku Black got up, and he had that weird smile. I don't know what that smile was about, man. I, I really do don't know what that smile was about though but you know it, it was pretty weird so then he says with both bodies and energy gathered by the gods you know he basically was all like you act like you own them you ignorant mortals so then i think vegeta throws like a huge yellow blast right after he said that though and like right after he said that he, you know he, he throws a huge yellow blast Buildings are shaking, rocks are like flowing through the sky, Vegeta's just looking down at him. I know you're not one to be defeated, you know, by just that, get out here, imposter. You know, he's basically, you know, t talking trash to him. So Goku Black gets up, right? You know, they're, they're fighting. Goku Black and Vegeta give that, um, you know, that anger stare. So then Goku Black was telling Vegeta... I now understand how you were able to improve so rapidly. You know, Goku Black is basically studying him, trying to take snippets of his power. It's anger, isn't it? The anger that your son was hurt made you strong, didn't it? You know, Goku Black was telling that to Vegeta. And, you know, Vegeta just, just sitting there like, you know, he's giving that face like, you know, what are you talking about? And Goku Black is like, now I realize, turn anger into power, you know? And then he was all like, it's an ugly method that only a mortal can think of, so I had to overlook it. I see anger. You know, and then he, he you know, he was going on and on and on. He was punishing himself. And the most epic part of the mall is when he, he, he you know, he, he was, he was stabbed himself with like some power kai. And he had, he had pulled out this pink Grim Reapers uh, thingy. Um, and, you know... He was trying to swing out Vegeta, and he was talking about how I've gained another new power, and, you know, if anger can be a source of strength, you know, then the anger I hold greater than anyone else's makes me the strongest. You know, that's what he was saying to, uh, to Vegeta. So, you know, like I said, you know, he tried to take a swing out Vegeta, and he could, you know, he was like, feel it for yourself, and obviously Vegeta was not having that. He was like, uh-uh. It's not gonna happen, it's too slow, where's the speed at? So right when he did that, Vegeta turns around and Goku Black, I don't know what he did, I don't know what that was about though, man, but he done ripped up like, a, he broke reality. He basically ripped up a, 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 another dimension. And Goku Black, he doesn't even know what that is. He was telling everybody, or at least Vegeta at least, who knows, even I don't know. So he ha has reached high power that he does not even know about. 
you know, he was, you know, they're discussing as, as a different universe, a future, or a different past, you know, how we don't, nobody knows, you know, but, you know, he, he was basically, you know, saying my power has surpassed even my own understanding, you know, by fighting Vegeta, you know, he's basically saying he, um, he reached untouchable heights or something like that. So it's a mild suit laughs, ha 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 ha. Fighting strong enemies brings up to even uh, greater heights. You know, that's true. Truly, the work of God. You know, so you know it's going back and forth. You know, what I mean, go uh, some Goku Black is a muscle are just not done. They're still you know hanging in there. And um, so then, Goku, I, you know, we all the Goku we know and love. We never expect him to do this. You're right open, and it sucker punches Zamasu. Boom! Punched into the building, black smoke everywhere, critical. So, you know, being that Zamasu's immortal, that's, that's not gonna hurt him, right? Of course, he's gonna get back up and, and dust that shit off. So, you know, uh, pretty much, you know, now Trunks is trying to fix up the time machine. He's in the thing with Boma or whatever. You know, um, trying to fix up the time machine, and then uh, my I think was hanging on to a building that was close. I mean, I I I don't know what happened there honestly, but um, yeah. So then, uh, L, and the most exciting part of it all is when Trunks used the Mafuba. I thought that was pretty epic. I thought that was pretty hype when Trunks used the uh, used the uh, Mafuba. You know, bro, it brought back my childhood days, man. It really did, though. It really did. You know, and he got it in. He got him in. But then he messed up at some point. And Zamasu ended up getting out. Now, the most, I think, ridiculous part of the whole episode, though, was when Boma tried to flirt with Zamasu. Why would you do that? You know, why, why, why would you put yourself in that predicament and situation knowing that Zamasu is not going to care about that? He's only looking, to, you know, to become godlike and everything like that. And, you know, but yeah, Bo Boma almost put herself in, 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 some, in some predicament stuff, man. He, she really did, though. But the most, you know, the most intense part of the episode was when Goku was like, hey, Vegeta, if these numbers are going up instead of down, you know, there was a bunch, and, l and let me remind you guys, there was a bunch of Goku Blacks, a bunch of them, you know, it, it was like, uh, it, 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 it was like after Image in a way, you know what I mean, it, it, it's crazy, you know, it was a bunch of Goku Blacks, um, and I think that either, and, you, you know, what happened was, yeah, so what happened was, I think Trunks came out, and I think that that's when he was um, trying to catch up to Zamasu or whatever, and that's how that happened. So then Goku Black um, noticed that something was going on. Uh, all the Goku Blacks uh, that disappeared because obviously they were trying to fight him. And Goku Black, you know, went over there to go see what was going on with Zamasu and the whole um, Trunks thing. And then as he instant transmission over there, so did Goku and Vegeta. And, um, yeah, we already know what happened after that. Zamasu and Goku Black was talking, no one playing games, we can't mess around. They took the portal earrings and fused and said, my form of justice. What kind of epic stuff is this, man? Like, yo, I can't wait to, for episode 65, man. It's gonna be hype. I can't wait for it. I know y'all can't wait for it, man. And, uh, yeah. Pretty much, and, 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 and it was said, though, I, I I think he was called Black Zamasu. I think that's what he's called, though. But he's called Black Zamasu, and um, people are saying that he has God Key from fighting Vegeta. All that pain he was taking from Vegeta, like, all that beatdown he was taking, he got uh, Vegeta's God Key. So, you know, and then you combine that with Fusion, with, with uh, Goku Black, you know that that's that's gonna be insane heights of power. God only knows how strong Black Zamasu is, man. We nobody knows how strong he's. I'm pretty sure he's pretty strong to the point where Goku and Vegeta are gonna have to fuse. They're gonna have to fuse. And like like and like I said in my other video, Vegeta is gonna return. I predict that Vegeta is gonna return because it only makes sense. Portal earrings versus portal earrings. It ain't no. It makes sense. 
doesn't make no sense to go uh for Gogeta to return though. But I'm I'm gonna end this video though, man. Um I just wanted to do my my um pretty much you know a review on episode 64 of dragon ball super i know it's pretty long i know um <laughs> i wasn't trying to make it that long but obviously it happened but um yeah um i'm gonna see y'all in the next video man as always subscribe stalk my likes and share this video with your friends um but as always it's your boy black emoji signing out peace